Hey, this is Matrix Yoshi here. Um, I'm going to be doing a walkthrough of Pointer's Way Arcade. Um, in my opinion, Fikri's best PowerPoint game ever created. And for that reason alone, um, I'm going to do a walkthrough of it. That, and I haven't done it yet. And the only walkthrough that's been done with this game has been sped up. So, yeah. Hmm. Okay, anyway. This is me, this is Hypercam. Hypercam sucks, I know, I don't have anything better. But I do have a headset, I feel special. So, um, I'm gonna stop and start the video just to make sure that I'm recording, okay? I am recording. Okay, I'm gonna restart it just because the music stopped. Um, you probably can't even hear the music, but if you can, cool. Yep. This is my new headset. I feel special. Uh, I'm gonna be using it like um, often when I get the dazzle. I'm gonna try and get that today at Best Buy or something. So, let's start the game. Be giving like tips and stuff along the way, so. Yep. Not using a password, not telling you the password, beat the game and find it out yourself. Okay? Let's start this thing. Whew. <clears throat> Ready? Uh, that's a strange question mark at the beginning, but whatever. Click the green pad to start. Yeah, you know you have a difficult game when the first screen has six buttons on it. That's not a good sign. Okay, just be patient. Yeah, finish has an exclamation mark at the beginning, too. Whatever. Okay, with the needles, I don't know what they're called, needles, stakes, whatever you want to call them. Um, they keep, like, a pattern if it helps you, maybe a rhythm. So, just go with the beat or whatever you see. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, these spinning things take about five seconds to get around fully. So, they're not going too fast, but the bigger they get, the more um, annoying they are. The faster you have to go, too. Okay, once again, keep a rhythm like duh, duh, something like that. Duh. 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 Yeah, you also have to be patient, but that's one thing I can't really tolerate. Do, do, do. Oh, um, tip for this game. For God's sake, never, 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 in the name of everything that is holy, use a touchpad. Always use a mouse. A touchpad sucks. Okay, it sucks. I can't emphasize that anymore. Um, yes, I can, but I don't want to. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is the only appearance of this enemy. All it does is stand still and look pretty. I guess it's just to uh, look better for the art style, but I think it's just kind of a waste of time. Wonder why he didn't use it again though. Guess he was like too lazy to put holes there. Anywho, not criticizing uh, Fikri anymore, let's just move on. Pretend like that never happened. Oh, poo. Okay, that's my first death. First roll, that's not a good sign, but... Never played this game before, it's okay. You got plenty of life. Even though it doesn't seem like it, as long as you're fast to click the button with the timer is going off, you're gonna be fine. I'm a bit tired. Um, right now it's like 11.30 in the morning, and that's actually getting up pretty early for me. Yep, school's gonna start soon. That sucks. Okay, next roll is fair again. No! Ah, sorry. Azure. Um, 
in my opinion, I think this one has the best music. Um, you can have your own opinion, like, whatever. I just like it because of all the flames. This is where rhythm falls into. Always keep a rhythm with the flames. They all go off at once, or they all, like, uh, alternate. Anyway, let's keep them going. Wait, actually, they might not alternate. Whatever. Keep going with the beat. You know, this is the game where all the music started to sound like upbeat or like remixes. Either way, it's good. This is probably the best soundtrack he's made so far. Pointer's Way Remake, I don't think was as good. Okay, once again, keep a rhythm. Uh, go in any order you like. As long as it's like not right to left and middle. Go middle, left, and right. Oh, it doesn't matter. Yeah, they don't alternate. They all go off at once. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention this. The raindrops that are going off right now are going to look terrible on a hypercam. Which, once again, I'm sorry for. Okay, once you click the button, you can go ahead and move. Even though it hasn't appeared fully on the entire uh, platform it hasn't filled the gap yet you can still go across like I can't really show an example like uh nah probably didn't count but all it does is zoom in it's actually there the whole time the second you click it so not that important to know but like if you're speed running um don't even bother noticing see Even though it looks like you can uh, go in the corner right here, don't. Just wait for them to go off. Nobody wants to take a chance. Blip. Even though this platform looks cool, this entire ring thing, it's kind of pointless. Don't bother, just go ahead and take the short path that I'm taking right here. Like, go right here. Anywhere else is kind of dumb. Okay, and now there is no short path anymore. Just kind of mess around if you want. Oh, poo. Okay, don't mess around if you want. Okay. <clears throat> um, by the way, is my microphone good? Uh, is it too fuzzy? Is this weird hearing my voice? Do you like the sped up videos better? I kind of hate them. Just because I, I didn't have a microphone at the time, and I sped it up to show, oh, not to show, to hide the fact that a hypercam looks terrible. It, it didn't do that well. But anyway, this is something new. I'm excited for Dazzle, so excited. I think I'm going to be doing a walkthrough of Mega Man 9. Um, <laughs> tough game. Okay, next is Asparagus. This world is pretty good. I don't know what pretty good means, but... It looks bad on a hypercam right now, but anyway, these things keep a beat. Everything does, I guess. Um, just go when they're open. I can't really say anything else. There's like a small little gap right here. You might not be able to see it on hypercam, but there's like this little green line. It looks like if you go over it, you'll die. Like going off the platform, you won't though. So anyway, when you're going through this thing, never slow down. Don't go too fast. Always Ugh, keep it running. Yeah. Been saying that way too much, I'll just stop. Always keeps a pattern, they all go off at once. But go relevantly slow here, just because you can slip off the mouse or the platform. So go, go, go. Uh. By the way, the timer isn't really important. It lasts for about a minute, I don't know really, but you should never really have to care about it the entire time, except during the boss. But that's at the very end of the game. <laughs> like, if you fail, then it... Yeah, that's... I don't even want to mention that. Okay, go on the outer side of the ring, like, going on the inner, these, like, a couple of pixels can kill you, so be careful. Um, 
By the way, Fikri, the art style in this world looks absolutely fantastic. Um, keep up the good work. I think these uh, rounded rectangle platforms are a little odd. Maybe like if you had an entire world based off of that, that's fine, but always find it just kind of meh, weird, I guess. Uncomfortable. Oh, uh, these are thick platforms. You don't have to go too slow. You can go pretty quick. Good place for speedruns. By the way, no matter what, no matter how fast the spinners are moving, always go with them. Even if you're doing a speedrun, you always have to do the same speed. 